it's important because exposome is something that really brings us to understanding why people cause, have diseases. So we know that genetics is very important and I'm basically from the field of human genetics and I think in genetics we have a lot of progress. We identified a lot of variants that are associated to disease but now we are left with a bigger part of unknown variants. Why do we develop diseases? why one person get to one condition and another person get to another condition. And I think most of these can be explained by environmental factors. And that's why now we have to link all kinds of environmental factors, exposome, to our genome for the personalized medicine. Now, microbiome is, of course, a very special organ. Yeah? On one side, it's considered to be internal exposome because it is inside us. On the other side, it's within the surface, yes, so it's, it's really something that is not belonging to the human body as well. So it's really on the edge of what we get from the outside, what our genetics bring to us, and what kind of metabolites we then have in our blood and our body. So I think by mediating the gut microbiome, we can change a lot in terms of individual reaction to the exposomal factors. We already know that not all medication work equally well for for everyone. Yes, for example, we know that people have huge variation in, that determines the dose of medication that will be efficient for them. And again, part of that is determined by host genetics, but a very large part is, for example, determined by microbiome. And more and more, we try to mediate the microbiome to make medication more efficient, for example. That is just one example. And I think we know very little about individual reaction to food. I believe we are just in the first baby steps to understand, for understanding that. But this is also something that everyone would like to know and that is very relevant for individuals' health. I am quite optimistic about that, yes. I think that we already see some examples where people use the personalized medicine for better health, for example, in pre-diabetic stage. Uh, they also look more and more for the gut microbiome. And I think in eight years we will be much closer for understanding what exactly is the individual-specific good food and individual-specific bad food.